Question, is it true that if you have a mentality challenged child, you have to give it up for adoption? No, this is not true. I've never seen the Amish give up their children for adoption. And if for some reason something were to happen to an Amish kid's parents, like um, both parents would pass away in a car accident, a family member, an aunt, an uncle, a grandparent, somebody would step in and raise their kids. I've seen it happen multiple times. Um, they do not give up their kids for adoption. So I don't know where this idea came from. Um, there was a couple of families in our community that had uh, kids that were uh, had developmental disabilities, and they went to the English, the Morrow County Board of MRDD Center. They had you know an educational program there for them, and they went there for many years. And these these children were probably into their you know even into their twenties, you know, and then the uh, there was a few more, so there was like five or six in our community. Um, so they actually trained an Amish teacher to be a special needs teacher, and they had a little special needs school in the Amish community with just the Amish kids because they had enough, you know, enough kids to make it worthwhile. So I know they, they take very good care of their own children. When I was baptized into the Amish church, I never once heard anything about any reasoning for giving your kids up for adoption if there had been i would have probably been one of those because i was always getting in trouble and listening to music and doing things i wasn't supposed to you know and i always wanted to leave the amish so thankfully the amish do not give their kids up for adoption or i might have been one of those thank you and god bless